What is up guys, it's Masses here today doing a review on LEGO Nexo Nice Set Battle Suit Macy. This is item number 70363 and it has 66 pieces. On the front of the box you can just see Battle Suit Macy and you can see that it comes with 5 Nexo powers. On the back of the box you can see how Macy goes into the battle suit and you can see how to play the game. Battlesuit Macy fully completed comes with 5 Nexo powers and the battlesuit itself. Taking a look at the battlesuit, first thing I want to do is show off right away this new mold for 2017, which is a sort of like cage like contraction. So, what you will do is with all the battlesuits, you can move it like this, and then it reveals the minifigure sitting inside. This is pretty nice, you know, it just flips back up like this, and you can see, you know, it's a pretty nice thing. You can also see in the middle, Macy's symbol, which you can also find on the Macy minifigures. Similar to all of the other battlesuits, Battlesuit Macy has a lot of articulation. Similar to Lance and the legs, you can see in the foot, you get all sorts of articulation. Move it all the way down, move it all the way up, you get ankle articulation being able to move side to side. The actual leg itself, you can kick it forward all the way up until it hits the actual, you know, cage contraption, and then you can move it all the way back until it hits the body piece. Articulation in the arms is a little more limited. You're able to move up and down like this. You can slash side to side like this. You aren't able to move up like this, which is unfortunate because all of the battle suits do have this waist articulation, which means the slashing in the arms, you're able to be able to get anyways. You know, if you want to slash a Macy's mace here, you're able to do that anyways. So, you know, personally, just like Lance, I would rather be able to move it up kind of like this. But, you know, unfortunately, that's not the case. You also are a little bit limited with the lack of forearms. However, that's fine since these hands are so big anyways, you're able to get a lot of articulation. It's pretty much all over the place anyways. Battlesuit Macy features a fully brick built mace and pretty much what you see is what you get here. You don't have any articulation whereas you would be able to move it say to the side like this or rotate it a little bit which is unfortunate however you know it's not that big of a deal since you know you can still use it it is you know still usable. You can attack your enemies like this but you are you know unable to rotate and get a little bit of a different look sometimes without actually moving the hands like this. On the other arm we have this new combo shield which is able to fit three nexo powers. You can also see three attachments here where you could put a clip piece. In this case I have these three nexo powers attached here, however there are two others in the set so you could swap them out if you don't like these three. On the back of all of these battle suits we have this orange clip piece and what you can do is if you have one of the actual nexo knight vehicles or you know Clay's Falcon Fighter Blaster, Aaron's Stone Destroyer, or Lance's Twin Jouster, you can take the alternate removable vehicles and you can attach it like this. In this case, I'm using the one from Aaron's Stone Destroyer, and then you get a more sort of powered up version of Macy. In this case, you will get some extra articulation with it, and you know, it gives you, you know, some different looks. There's only one minifigure in Battles with Macy, and that of course is Macy. However, I do really like this one. Similar to some of the other Battlesuit figures, this gives me a more regal vibe. Now, with this Macy minifigure, it's just like all the other ones, you're able to lift up the visor and you can see the hairpiece fell off. And that's because the hairpiece isn't really the best attached. However, it is definitely better than attachment from last year, but it's definitely not the best attachment of the hairpiece. On the back, we once again get that nice printing from the front, and when you remove the helmet, you can see an alternate face. The Nexo powers that include this set are as follows. Wrecking Ball, Iron Dragon, Battle Cry, Slime Blast, and Mightiness. Despite that Battlesuit Macy is very easily the simplest of all the Battlesuits and contains the least amount of pieces, I was actually pleasantly surprised with this set. This set's defining characteristics that really set it apart from the rest of the Battlesuits are very easily the boots and the upper arms or shoulders. The articulation in this set is once again very good which my only issue would be that you can't move these arms you know, up like this but instead you can slash them, which I mean, when you already have the waist articulation and you're able to do that anyways, 
is a little bit disappointing to me. The other issue with this set is that the hairpiece on Macy's visor is going to be easily knocked off, which is going to be very annoying for play. But if you can get past that, I don't think much people are going to have much issues with this set. The main issue with the battle suits for most people is that the heads are just way too small and they feel out of proportion. However, I feel Macy handles this better than most of the other battle suits, so that's not going to be too much of an issue. If you can get past all that, the battle suit Macy is going to be a very, very good set for you. The amount of posability you get with it is very good, the playability you get is good, the 5 Nexo powers included are going to be good, and you're really going to especially get good value if you play the game because then you get all those Nexo powers to play in the game. And the ability to combine your powers is also very nice. The actual Macy figure included in the set is very nice, and just the set itself I don't have really any problems with. So yeah, that's pretty much it for my review on Battlesuit Macy, hope you guys enjoyed, Till next time, see you guys later.